we doing guys? Welcome to another Main Meister 10 minute mashup. Uh, today's game we're looking at Nitro on the Commodore Amiga. Now I'm actually playing this on a proper Amiga rather than emulation today so I figure I need to start kind of making. I'm just getting a bit lazy actually not using proper hardware. Um, obviously when I'm looking at stuff like Auric and things like that and I don't have the, the, the sort of hardware but when I'm uh, making videos with proper hardware that I've got then I should really be using it. So anyway, enough of my waffle. Um, a rather odd looking uh, title screen, if that's the word for it. I don't know quite what's going on with that thing on the right hand side's chest. Anyway, enough of that. Apparently it's a car racing game. Right, keyboard joystick. Uh, so this is made by Signosis. Who do we start? Right, now, if that's not a computerised Clint Eastwood, I don't know what is. Now, I don't think I ever actually played this game. I used to play, is it Supercars? There were Supercars 1 and 2, which came out um, by, was it Gremlin Graphics, I think it was? And I know this looks kind of kind of similar. So, I am a little grey cat. Oops. This was a really, really popular genre on the Amiga. Obviously, it was kind of popularised, if that's the right word for it, by. Uh, what was I going to say? What was the name of it? Quidmasters. What was the name of that game? Micro Machines. That's what I'm trying to think of. Now, it would help if I actually knew where I was supposed to be going. Ah, so it's one lap. Right, okay. Well, I got zero points here. Mr. Amateur. Guessing you can kind of upgrade your car. Not quite sure how I do that, but anyway. Yeah, yeah, we've seen that picture. Why is it that computer control cars always have ugh, much better acceleration than uh, players' cars? That's always a tad unfair if you ask me. I think my scar lead in the computer is a wee bit flaky. Just my second place here. Well, at least I've got a point. Right, who die? Nitro boost. We want traction, that's what we want. Better traction, there we go. Is that it? I think I've uh, exhausted my money already. So let's see if this makes any difference. There's actually quite a good uh, similar kind of plain game uh, that came out on the iPad. Can't remember exactly what it's called, but. Colour keeps going, so I do apologise about that. Oh, arse, where am I going? 
you know what, I haven't a clue where I'm going here. I have got no idea where I'm supposed to be going here. <laughs> I've got to say, the, uh, it's not obviously, it's not really clear as to where you're supposed to be going. You can see that, even the, the computer car got lost. I'm just noticed this is going a bit wonky again. It's typical squint cam. Doesn't matter, we're used to it anyway. anyway. That uh, Scarlet would stop moving. Oh, night time. Scary. Now, if the game was impossible before, it's just stupidly impossible now. I mean, the only reason I've got any. Ah, bollocks. Yeah, I'm not convinced about that game. Looks nice. Yeah, I'm going to try and fix this. Uh, fix the scarp problem. Stay! Yeah, let's give it one more go. No, it's been any nonsense. Right, I'm guessing you could have more than one person playing at once. That's quite a good idea, I suppose. I mean, it's nice graphics, not bad sound. They've just, mm, don't know, they've just kind of made it. They've made it slightly too cumbersome to play, there's far too many things to kind of crash into. And like I said, it's not always obvious where you need to be going. I mean, I'm only talking about, you know, I've only done, this is, well, this is the first track, but I've only actually done one track so far. Sorry, I've only done three tracks so far and, you know, normally they, they kind of, it takes a wee while to sort of, uh, ramp the difficulty up and it could certainly do with having a slightly more uh, laps as well per game yeah not convinced so it's nice graphics but it's just a wee bit too difficult for my liking Certainly, I prefer supercars. It's you know, it's uh, you know where you stand with that. This just tries to be slightly too clever. I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just me. I really don't know. But you know, if I want to play a race game, that's all I want to do. But what I've always like, tried to do is I've tried to make it like sort of Mad Max, science fictiony type, futuristic type thing with power-ups and god knows what else, but I would much rather just have a straightforward racing game so you can see exactly where you're supposed to be going. And it's got absolutely nothing to do with the fact that I am absolutely pants at it, nothing at all. Anyway guys, that's enough of that, uh, that's Nitro and that's by Psygnosis and that is on the Commodore Amiga. Um, as usual guys, thank you so much for watching.